Hi guys, I'm gonna show you how to make a lightened up kale Caesar salad. Some days call for a little bit of a lighter dressing and I don't always love to do the mayo and the eggs, so I'm gonna show you how simple it is. We're doing some basic ingredients. We have, of course, olive oil as the base, shallots and garlic. The shallot will just give it that extra juice of flavor. We've got lemon juice, Dijon mustard, anchovies, and Parmesan cheese. So we're gonna throw everything in the blender and then we're gonna toss it with gloves with the kale. I'm gonna massage it. You'll see how easy it is. no secret that I like gloves because for a lot of reasons I like to maintain the quality of my manicure. We're gonna take our dressing. I'm gonna drizzle some on. Remember never to drizzle the entire dressing on. Put a little bit and then we're gonna start to zhuzh it in and see how we go. The reason I use gloves to massage this in is because I can really get the dressing kind of infused into the kale so it just, it just marries better. I'm gonna add a little surprise ingredient for you. One of my favorite little snacks are these Parmesan crisps. You can make them really easily at home. This has some everything seasoning, some poppy seeds and sesame seeds. I just thought it would give the salad a really fun crunch. Of course, we're gonna add this in addition to regular Parmesan because double cheesy is never a bad thing. And I didn't put the Parmesan in the dressing because I like it to last. If you put the Parmesan in the blender, the dressing will probably only last a day or two, but this way my dressing will last all week. Yum, I'm just gonna have a huge Jungus bite because I'm starving. Mm. I love this salad so much. And um, the crispy Parmesan, mm. can you hear me chewing? It's just like, mm. Mm. best thing ever. You'll never miss eggs and mayo in Caesar salad again. Go make it.